Hey everybody, it's Gadget Fish or GT doing a taste test. What I love best. Um, this is coming from my favorite vegan burger company so far, Beyond Meat. I'm now trying their sausages, Beyond Sausages. And I got this at Shiler's, I believe that's how you pronounce it, at 86 and 2nd Avenue. If you leave the right exit, you will actually position yourself to be across the street. That's my tip for you. And what's cool, from the minute I got there, there was branding of the Beyond Sausage outside the place, on the napkin holders, and even on this awesome takeaway card that lets you know what's actually inside the sausage. And that's where the magic begins. It's just beets, potatoes, coconut oil, fava beans, and peas. And it has 16 grams of protein, no soy or gluten, no GMOs. I'm here for it. I have this philosophy. If a vegan hot dog or sausage is worth tasting, it will taste good by itself and of course with the fixing. So I'm going to let you know if I'm going to love it, leave it alone, or if it's just okay. And I actually have all three flavors, so let's just get into it. So this is the brat. I'm gonna let you know if it tastes good without the fixings. Love it or leave it alone. I love it. It smells good. It has just the right amount of fat, crunch. Mmm. Now I'm going to try it with the fixings. So this is the Beyond Classic. See if I'm going to love this or leave it alone. Mm. Mm. I, I, wow, I can't believe this is vegan. Wow. Very good. Let's go to the sweet sausage. Love it or leave it. You know, you know what's making me go wow? When you bite into it, it has this nice pop, like pow. And that's what it feels like, pow in your face. I have to admit, I don't taste a huge difference between the sweet and the brats, but it's just really good. So this is the sweet Sicilian. Love it or leave it. This one's really good. What I'm, what I'm finding interesting about, besides the sausage being phenomenal, it's the toppings they're suggesting, which is taking it to another level. Oh, so far that's my favorite. Last but not least, this is the hot sausage without the bun. I love it. Wish it was a smidget hotter, but it's so freaking good. And I really hope this is vegan because it does not taste vegan to me. 
smells freaking amazing. Wow. Let's try it with the suggested toppings before I just start crying. So this is the ban, the ban meat. I think I'm, I'm sure I'm saying this wrong. Um, love to leave it. Oh my god. Mm. 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 I'm so sorry. Beyond me. Oh my God. This was worth, th there was a huge thing getting sausages, got caught in the snow, other stuff went wrong. Your sausage just took all that away. I can see clearly now. What the hell? How did you guys do this? I forgot to mention in this one, I did not have the jalapeno jalapeno peppers and now that I've took a few more bites there is enough heat so I'm glad to do it this is just so amazing I whoa okay out of all the sausages I I'm sorry I can't pick one can I pick one I can't even get the words out <sighs> if I had to pick one this is such a tough choice um I probably like the hot one the best, but I loved it for whatever insanity it took for me to get this sausage, it was worth it. I cannot wait till this is in stores. This is so freaking delicious. I can't believe this is gluten-free. I can't believe the ingredients I can pronounce. I know what this stuff is. I cannot believe this was so freaking good that I almost cried. Either there's something emotionally wrong with me or that was damn good sense. Was, oh, I can't get the word out. Sausage. <laughs> All right, guys. It's been a long day and it's showing. So until my next post, Gadget Trish is out. Think vegan. Bye.